Hello. Nomad's Sculpt. The mirror tool. Okay, I switch to the Nomad app. Um, I show a few examples. Um, this is uh, created with the mirror tool. That's, um, you can create um, a shape and um, scale it along, um, like a scale along a path, but um, you have to mirror it and um, scale it and mirror it. It only takes a few minutes uh, to do this. Um, or another example is um, this. This is the same technique. The object you mirror is um, totally egal. Um, and use mirror, um, set an angel um, that you mirror it and uh, scale it and or uh, duplicate it and, um, and so on and so on. And a last example. This is uh, like a profile um, on furniture or something you can create or hard surface modeling. Um, there are many, many possibles, possibilities uh, to do, I hope that's the right word, uh, to do things with the mirror tool. Okay, I create a new scene and First we use uh, the um, sphere, that's okay. And here in the symmetry settings, uh, you can show the planes. And sorry, I turn off the gizmo edit. Um, we need it later. And the normal use of the, um, the mirror is uh, the symmetry. Um, I turn the symmetry off and I'm dragging a little bit uh, on the on the sphere, and now you um, have one side uh, with this, uh, and if you want to uh, mirror it back, um, use the mirror tool. You can select the planes, and in the mirror settings, you can use the right to the left and then your sculpt appears on the other side and it's exactly symmetric. Um, okay, you can also uh, add um, another plane, for example, the blue set plane, um, and use uh, left to the right, or sorry, it's the wrong direction, right to the left, and Sorry, um, on the mirror tool you can, yes, useful, it's only to mirror one side um, um, to make this and then switch off the other side and um, um, do, do it again here to bring it on the blue plane on the other side. Okay. I go back. Um, now there are one plane is activated and um, I use the drag brush and turn the symmetry on and now it's active and um, the mirror works live at sculpting sozusagen. Okay, in, you can um, now add planes and uh, do it on multiple planes. On a sphere it's um, easily possible to do this. Um, okay, I switch them off. That's a normal way to use the mirror. Okay, but uh, to do the examples before, I add a, a cube. And I bring it a little bit in 
in the other form. We use an object like this and in the symmetry settings you can reset um, the, the mirror planes and in the gizmo settings you can move your object um, to the center when you need it. Uh, it's sometimes important to bring the objects back in a position um, like this. Okay, in the mirror settings there's on the bottom um, symmetrical edit is experimental but you can use it. Turn gizmo edit on and now when we use a, a tool, um, not the not the gizmo, uh, and bring now you can adjust uh, the plane, the position of the plane, where it um, should do something, and you can um, in the in the gizmo settings you can here. Um, um, Edit um, the the angel, and when you use now um, the gizmo edit, it snaps in this angel. But in the gizmo edit, there's no angel um, adjusting possible. And now you got the when I go to the to the right view. Um, you see, now the, the plane is in a 45 degree angel. And now you can use the mirror tool uh, left to the right and you can mirror it in this direction. Oh, I, um, the angel was 20, 22 degrees. Um, That's, I don't know if it is possible to set the 20.5, uh, it's 30, um, and okay, and now a um, mirror is, um, is active in, in this um, angel and you can mirror it now in this 22 degrees and you can uh, bring bring the um, the mirror planes in orientation reset a world center and orientation you can bring it always back in a position you want and um, now you can bring it um, in a another position and now it's um, a 90 degree um, position and you can use the mirror again left to the right and this happens. And Okay, um, it doesn't matter um, that the object is too long on one side, uh, you can trim it off. Uh, use always a complete um, object or use yes or, or um, uh, not to trim it um, split it and then use um, the tool um, for example you can now split the object make um, hole filling if you need um, you can bring it there and um, now you can split the object and I turn the outline on and when you now use the mirror tool um, 
Gizmo edit is on. And now you can bring it in a position. like this and mirror from the left to the right yes and yeah, then you can work uh, your work can go on um, you can do things um, like this it's um, you can test it and play around with it um, and when you trim something, um, make sure uh, that you, your trim orientation is uh, straight or perpendicular to your view. And um, okay, but. Um, you can do funny things with a mirror tool and there are more possibilities but i now finish the video okay have fun with sculpting ciao